Hey everyone, the Meters Nerd, welcome back to the kingdom! We got attacked by cows last time, apparently, and I cannot find a comfortable sitting spot in this goddamn chair. The chair is good. I'm not yelling at the chair. It's a good chair. It's helped my back. It's the, it's the floor. And that sounds like I am exaggerating and making stuff up, but I'm really not! The floor is fucked up! I'm not joking. The floor in this apartment, so bad, how bad, it's so bad, if you put a marble down, it just rolls to the end of the, 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 the apartment, the other end of the apartment, there we go. And that sounds like a joke, because it has the classic setup of, this so-and-so is so-and-so, and then you ask, uh, how so, and then you answer. You know, it's, it's a classic, classic joke. But my life isn't a joke, Pamela. <laughs> I am running a very little sleep. I I live uh, it's I live in the middle of the city. And by city I don't mean like a huge fucking city. It's the third largest city in the country, and by that I mean it's like three hundred thousand people here. Which isn't a lot if you're from like basically any other country. I should rescue this person before I go on a rant. You consume the meal and then rescue the dweeb. Uh, path two. There, we we built something up here. This has to be removed. Uh, yeah. So we live in the middle of the city. Our bedroom window is straight out into the uh, the the street. So we we hear that it's it's, it's a, there's a bus stop there. So we hear the buses and we hear the cars and hear whatever and that's fine. I can sleep with the buses going back and forth, unless they explode, I guess. But then I, the sleeping isn't really my biggest problem. Just gotta check and see if everyone's been tended to. Uh, yeah, but the last few days, two or three days, uh, there's a hotel on the other side of the, the street. That hotel, during this uh, time of COVID, decided to refurbish their the outside of their hotel. Which this actually, when I'm thinking about it, this has been going on for weeks, only with with intermissions. Uh, yeah, so so they are doing some stuff to the what's what's it called in English? The facade, the outside. Which is stone, and rock, and concrete. And at 7 in the fucking morning, they start drilling the outside. They just start fucking drilling in the rock. 7 a.m. 7 a.m. is early. If you work... Well, I am furloughed, so I don't really work. But I, I wouldn't complain if they if they did some... some they made noise during the day. It's fine. I'm okay with that. At seven in the morning? That loud? It's too much. It's just too much. And I I can't sleep because it's holy fuck, what is this? Why aren't you making food? Well we've we've been fighting, I guess. And these are all the the bonus cows. So I haven't really been sleeping a lot the past few days, and I, I spent four minutes of the beginning of... Hello. Beginning of this episode. Talking about how... You okay there, dweeb? How I haven't been sleeping well, and so you shouldn't expect a lot of uh, energy during this uh, this episode. Well, I guess I, I had enough energy to at least rant for four minutes, so maybe maybe we're gonna be good. That's that's the, one of the beautiful things for me, at least when I when it comes to recording, is that I get more energetic when I start recording. So I was I was basically asleep in my chair. It's I don't know how much it is in Fahrenheit, but it's currently 11 in the evening, 2300 hour before midnight and it's 22 degrees here and as I've said it before this is Norway 
can hear the seagulls there, they're going fucking mad. Which is another thing. <laughs> I am a prickly old man. It's really warm. We don't have AC here, because if you if you lived in Norway, you would know that having AC here is fucking insane. And we're not insane people at, at the moment, at least. I'm not sure where I'm going with this. I, I am not sleeping well. Because people are destroying buildings around us. And it's warm. And... Uh, Yesterday, well, we, we we have a seasonal visitation of birds. They nest on top of our building, <clears throat> and then the 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 when the the seagull child hatches, it falls down on the pavement right outside our apartment. Hasn't we really, haven't really been struggling with it this year, but last year was was hell, and it just stays right outside our apartment door right outside our apartment window in a fairly crowded street and it stays there for days and weeks and it just it, it leads to attacks and yesterday we were out walking and we walked through a, a small small alleyway side street and if if we didn't have the sun in our back i would never see that there was a fucking giant ass seagull attacking me it made no noise, and they're loud beasts. But not this particular psychopath. No, no, no. This one decided to to be the most quiet bird of all time. And if we had the sun in our faces, I would never have seen that it basically landed on me. It was like it was half a centimeter away, apparently. Basically on me. I absolutely forgot about the psychic rain, by the way. Chronological age and biological age are different things, right? <clears throat> let's try to get the... Uh, let's try to get back into the game. My point is, it's warm. Not sleeping well. Birds are not real. They are... they are murder beasts. And when you start loudly working in a residential area at 7 in the fucking morning, you deserve to be taken down by Khabib Nurmagomedov and kept there until he decides he's fine with uh, the amount of destruction he's wrought upon you. The doe has been self-tamed, by the way. I should uh, tell him to get in. And then we should... Her, I'm sorry, it's a doe. And then we should slaughter her. Well, no, we don't need to. We have we have tons of food. We also have quite a huge, huge, quite a decent amount of, of kibble. Why did you just drop your food? Someone could have fed you. Starvation. Well, someone could have fed you. Food poisoning is is you're eating kibble, brother? <laughs> no. Eat a, eat a lavish meal, you, you deserve it. Taking kibble? What's wrong with you, man? What the hell is wrong with you? There you go. Need research project? There's nothing interesting to research. Ba -da 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 -da. Don't, don't. I also saw that the... I'm not sure how it is... Uh, other places and it's it's not like it there's it's insane over here but sunset is at 11 30 tonight so it's gonna be incredibly warm and it's gonna be incredibly bright and loud apparently so if you want to get eight hours sleep I, I'm I'm starting work tomorrow at 12 and I guess I could just get up at seven o'clock to get eight hours of sleep, I gotta get. I gotta go go to bed before the sun goes down. You know, that's comfortable. I'm happy with that. I should. Should I pay? How much would that? We should. 
should put down some leather flooring. How much steel do we have? We have we have a few blocks. Should possibly save the steel. Or pave tile. It doesn't go down here often enough to actually warrant a uh, desire boy, I'm sorry, desire path. I boy. We should put up some some other flooring in here, I feel, but that is not important. We're walking down here quite often. That's not that's not too cheap too cheap too expensive. That's ninety steel. That's nothing. It's nothing. Also, I hope that you haven't aged too much. Yeah, this road, we're, we're, we're actually removing this road, I remember now. So we can actually, we can just pave it. What if we just do this? Huh? What if we just do that? Maybe we'll put up a, an outhouse here, yeah, yeah, yeah. What rock do we have? Rock? Block? Do sandstone, let's do a sandstone. Building. Just to do it. Don't ask me why. Let's keep it. Need warm clothes? Well, how about you shut the fuck up? Real nice if the psyche grain stopped. Haven't felt. I think I, I looked at Ilya as well when the psyche grain stopped, and uh, he hasn't aged at all. <clears throat> well, one day, chronological age, 53 years and 8 days. Biological age, 53 years and 9 days. So I think we've dealt with it properly. Because because he's one of the ones that is actually outside a lot. Steel? Where? Ooh, nice. More steel. How about we cancel these? Just in case there's an infestation there. And we're not really that strung up on steel anymore. <clears throat> you are in serious pain, but you're probably patty. Can I change your name to Patty? Patty David? How about just Patty? Patty David, Patty David. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that took me by surprise. How about we just call you Patty? Her title is Tamer, Patty Tamer, yeah. Patty David, Patty David was very good though. I, I enjoyed that. Oh Jesus. The regular rain stopped. The psychic rain can actually come on top of the regular rain. I don't know why you decided to walk up here. Is that really faster? This way is faster than just this way? Gotta think about that. Patty David, Patty David. Not sure if we're getting a lot of rice. I feel like the animals are eating most of it. Quest available. Malone's bugs. 47 year old Framer. Fra fra Framer. The Malone is calling from nearby. She says she poisoned an underground insect colony, but now she's soaked in insect pheromones and the bugs are hunting her. 
19 hives? How about you? We don't have room for it. I'm so sorry. My apologies. Chronological age is higher than biological age. Patty didn't like the name change. New lovers, Sam and Patty. Well, Sam tried to flirt with Patty by telling a tale about Xeno humans. Patty became aroused and agreed to become Sam's lover. They're so sleeping over there, there now. So this this room is. It's, it's fine if it's not being used. We should also, while I'm thinking about it, just do, just do one of these. Just mine that. Patty David, Patty David. Patty David, Patty David. Let's, let's look at the... Uh, let's clear this area. I don't I don't want them to to eat the rice. They are allowed to eat the hay. It's no problem. Dun, 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 ba, dun. And we're go we're going to go up here and clear this out as well after a while. This this there are 27 meals. How do we send Isco? Aged one extra day. It's not a huge problem. It's not like these people are gonna... Nice. It's not like these people are gonna... Survive and or... Not escape before... Before they die of old age. Can you not? Can you only haul ten at a time? Ah, man. Ah, man. Patty David, Patty David. Patty David, Patty David. Bonnie has aged one extra day. <clears throat> Constraining clothes? Well, I didn't tell you to put them on, did I? No. Da -da -da. Awful bedroom. Where are you sleeping? You're here sleeping there. How about I put you Kagara? Here. Surely, a slightly impressive bedroom would be better. Slept in the cold, dude. Slept in the cold, insulted, hungry. Yeah. Oh, dude, we. That's what we should do. The next raider or independent that comes in here, we're just gonna take their liver. All right? We're just gonna take their liver. Ratty apparel slept in the cold. Ratty apparel. No one's complaining about their bad bedroom, impressive bedroom. All right. Kagura slept in the cold. Yeah, well, who cares? <laughs> Shut up. Chili. How much wood do we have? Hello. No wood, I'm guessing, though. Yeah, no wood. Barely any wood on the map. That's fine. Da -da -da -da. Aged uh, seven extra days here. Oh, dweeb? You haven't left the map yet? Pardon? We're fine. We're fine without it. Goto Dynasty likes us a little bit more. We're allied with the Fallen Dominion. That's nice. Do do do. 
Do 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 do. Those are just a bunch of muffalo here. Da -da -da. A cougar. Shouldn't pose any sort of threat to our colony. Not at all. There's an ambrosia sprout here. Do you want to harvest that? There's a huge amount of ambrosia here. Sure. Sure. You also gotta harvest some... Uh, no, don't need that. Chop some wood. Paddy no longer paying out on food. Pogging out on food. Since I'm not terribly afraid of... Uh, 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 uh. Unrestricted for a while. See what the wargs do. Hopefully they go out hunting. Hunting. Because we got some puppies that are starving starving and we don't want that. Maybe they're not actually hunting for themselves. You Newton. You are butchering. Fantastic. Paddy David, Paddy David. So we we have figured out that we're not afraid anymore. Psychic rain. We, we should be wa wa wary, very, very wary. We should be wary um, of the psychic rain, but we shouldn't let it let it define us. I will thank you so much for watching, though. Uh, I'm the Bigger I'll see you next time. Bye for now. <laughs>